Hey, Pep Tavanex, welcome back to Pep TV. This is the sports segment, and we're at the Garden Sporting Complex again. And today's matchup, well, Challengers versus St. Peter's. We're going to try to get you some second half action of that. And then the big one, it is Newtown versus Spurs. That one going to be a dog fight. All right. On Thursday, I had one game which uh, SPD and uh, Strikers played to a 1 1 draw, even though SPD started off so well to win their first game over St. Paul's. They drew with Strikers. Now, on Saturday, the football action was done in St. Paul's. My team, Ranville Superstars, they came up against Mantab, and I was surprised to see Al back in the goal after he said, Done, you know, done. And um, it was good to see Val with the team now. So let's hope he continue that. All right. So they told me Steven scored a penalty to make it 1-0 in favor of Village. I was just hoping that Village would build on that momentum and get some more goals. Let's go check out that game. All right, into the second half, and this play was called offside. Look where Steven is, look where the last player is, but uh, it was called offside. This is Powerman. Powerman looking for Mugged. Mugged chasing down the ball. Gets here now. And see the ball from the defender. It's still with Mugged. Wins. Out. Oh, that. See you later, dude. Bang this one across. Put it on a plate. And Pringle so happy to have it. And dedicate that one to his baby. Yes, very good. What a Akesh. Yeah, Akesh getting sweat by. This is Joel. Joel wins out. Back to Joel. Well, luckily, come back to Joel. And Joel just slots this one. Joel to Akesh. Akesh. Akesh want to control and want to slot the way! Are you kidding me? Ak Akesh, but you, Akesh is scoring now. Hey, you, you score. You support. Oh boy, are you serious, man? Look at Joel. Slips this one through. Nah, nah, tread the needle. Nah, she, nah, she tread up the needle. And Akesh put that one away with a little bit of finesse. And it was 3 0 in favor of Village. Everybody is happy except Akesh. That's how this one end 3 0 to village. Three points to three points, you know. So I just want to pick up the blocks. Yeah, big up shingle on the goal for the baby. Back in my own south of youth on the line, you know. Akish, we're going to have to have some celebration classes for you. You, you. you didn't do very well. In fact, you didn't do well at. Uh, that was embarrassing, actually. But uh, congrats on the goal, same myself. Second game. Now we're talking. Yeah. It is a, a finals rematch, St. Paul's versus Connery. Now in the President's Cup, Connery scored for St. Paul's comeback and brushed him up. Now they're in St. Paul's. So let me see how this one's going to come out. St. Paul's versus Connery. Enjoy. Well, everybody talking about Redman, how Redman could leave and this and that. So you know it's going to be a dog fight. Here comes Arby, first minute of the game. Wins <laughs> out, that runs leave Marvin. Met there by Mara. Mara stops the play right there. Arby turns, fakes a the pass, then he gets it across now. Uh, out there says, Connery goes to skip. Fatish on the goal, gets a deflection, and it's in the back of the net. Oh, FG, first minute of play, and it's 1-0 to St. Paul's. Let's see if we can run back that again. Um, skip drives this one, gets a deflection right there, bounces the other way, keeper going one way, ball going the other, he slips and it's in the back of the net. Look at it again. Looks like it hits Spinal on the arm right there and it bounces the other way. Goalkeeper gone and it's 1-0 in the first minute of play to St. Paul's. Game on. Here comes Spinal using that speed of his. This is Spinal all alone for the shoot. Roly poly to the goalkeeper. This is Spinal again. Chips is one over for Atis. Atis, are you serious? Oh boy, now this is. Hey, wait a minute. He ain't outside. Well, it turns it. Me ain't outside. We took the goalkeeper and backed it in the back of the net. Just like that. It is two. Oh boy, pulls out the arrow. Fires. Well, well, wait a minute. Look where he is. I don't know where he is when the ball was played, but looking at that, it looked offside to me. But I guess not to the linesmen, not to the St. Paul's fans as well. It is 2-0 to St. Paul's. This is at this, guess this ball inside to Terrell to make it number three. Terrell Spanang pulls it to the rescue to keep it at 2-0. Connery, Redman, anything Redman tried. They were on him like white and rice. He was getting nothing work at all. They were making sure of that. During the halftime, Marao got electrocuted. The ambulance had to come for him. So they had to make a change and bring on this dude. Like, he's got on a tights, is he? 
I don't know, could be wrong. Here comes Connor. He's looking to get something out of this one. Ewell upset with himself. What an easy chance. Now, this is St. Paul's looking to make it number three. Goes into Asad. Oh, he always finds a way to score on Connery. Not this time around. Connery with a shot and goal. Oh, boy, that one just goes over the bar. Connery still looking to get something out of the game. Oh, straight into the arms of the goalkeeper. This is uh, Tristan. Tristan just touch it. Just too much. Carry him saves the day. Eh, man in tights with a brilliant pass. We had a brilliant pass to Tristan. And Tristan is going to bang this one straight to the goalkeeper. And he makes the save. This is Arby. Arby with the assist earlier. Arby cuts back and Arby fighters. What a goal! Just over the post on that occasion. Now, here comes uh, Terrence once again. Turning on that speed. Running away from the defenders. Fires a shot and it goes wide. Two goals to nil in favor of St. Paul's. Well, in my opinion, Connery came out flat. And when you come out flat against St. Paul's, in St. Paul's, you can put yourself in problems. And the early goal from Skip really punched them. Now, in the second half, though, um, they came out a bit depressed because um, Madasso, Madao, understand, he was electrocuted, literally electrocuted. And so he had to be taken to the hospital. So the team came out a little bit out of it. But I just spoke to Mali and he told me that he went to the hospital and they talked to him. And so he's actually speaking. Now, because Mo was giving me some kind of ton of ice story and unconscious and so on. So, Madao, um, just hope that you have a speedy recovery and everything goes back to normal. All right, uh, maybe the electrocution could make you a little more sane. I uh, you know you're crazy still, you know? Yeah, but on a real note though, I wish you all the very best. Okay, now for the football action. Right now, as I told you, I think St. Peter's leading the game. God, just a little while come in and I see Cubs score a penalty. So, um, they're going down in the locker room. So, right now, I'm going to give you some second half action of St. Peter's versus Strikers. But really and truly, I come here for Spurs versus New Tongue. You know what I'm But give you some bonus, same still, you know? Enjoy. Nets enjoying his game with his new team right about now. And here comes uh, St. Peter's looking for more. This is Kirkland. Squad already can he score again. Oh, brilliant save this time from the goalkeeper. But right after that, here comes St. Peter's again. And it's in the back of the net. Kirkland Harris, second goal of the day to make it a four. Here comes uh, what? Challengers with a move of their own. Goalkeeper can't hold on. Out to the St. Peter's. Back in there, says challengers. Oh to deal. Oh to deal. And they save that one from going in. Here comes St. Peter's trying to make it number five. This is Harris Kirkland. Scored before, but they banged this one across. And Zidane, you serious? OMG. Here comes St. Peter's trying to make it number five. Yes! That's your way to make it number five. Complete the slap. Psh! Oh boy, here comes Challengers trying to get something. Hey! Hey! Uh, we have called a free kick, but this looked like it was in the box to me. He goes down, he goes fly, and it was a free kick. Here comes St. Peter's, tall up, looking for more, gets it on the inside, but the shot across. Hey, Brenton helping out St. Peter's, man. My man gets six and done, man. Round it off, you know. Six goals to nil in favor of Harry Spain, St. Peter's. Alright, so it is game on. Here comes uh, Spurs with attack and the goalkeeper knocks it one out of there. We, we had a little jersey malfunction going on there. Vidal had to switch his jersey after Tishan had to whip it off. And now here comes uh, Spurs on the attack. This is Tishan Handley. Wins by the shot and the goalkeeper to the rescue once again to keep it at nil nil. Now, here comes uh, Spurs, turns, this is Tishan, oh, wins one, still with Tishan, nobody going to Tishan, anybody, another one, next, anybody, anybody, just, just stop it, oh, watch here, you not gonna lose, Lloyd down there, and the youngster, new to the team, picks up a yellow card for his attempt to bring down Tishan, here comes uh, New Town, oh, rinse out that, but a shot and goal, ah, not bad, not bad at all, into the second half, done better, uh, Spurs making a change to bring on Mr. Bertie. Out to there says Newtong inside. There, Father. Oh boy. E.T. making a switch to Spurs to get some playing time. Could have scored there. Hey, Father shot a goal. Block. But Rompe! Goal. 
Ian Rompy leg never let Newtown down yet to make it 1 0 against the win of play. Uh, there's a shot, hits Savage on the backside. Goalkeeper out the goal, but Rompy said, Thank you very much. And it is 1 0 to Newtown Spurs. Looking equalizer. Just might have to send him to quick bargains. Wait a minute, they could get it now. We said the goalkeeper out to the off the line, says Vidal to save it at 1 0. Here comes the Spurs looking equalizer. India, out there, India, out there, India. Oh, boss, it's out to the Nice goal. Go, go. No, it is offside. Huh, boy. Here comes Spurs on the attack. Still trying to get equal as the fight. Of course, nobody's home. Huh, boy. Burgers, I'm through. He just to leave Newton and Coke zero. Anyway, here comes Spurs looking uh, equalizer. The super sub. Carlos Berti just coming off the bench. Oh, big silly. No, big silly. That's a big silly. But I lie. Ball comes over. Goes back across goal. Uh, can the goalkeeper get it? Yeah, I don't know, man. But anyway, it is one goal apiece. Equalizer. Here comes your turn to go back up. The goalkeeper controls this one. He throws it out. Looking for Tishan Henley. Tishan Henley control turns and he's looking for Bertie. Bertie makes a run. They were asking if it's offside. Look like a good one. What a, what a, what a. Yes! And it is 2 1 in the space of two minutes. Let's see that one again, Mr. Bertie. Is he offside? Look at Bertie. Look at where, the, where he is when the ball was passed. Certainly not offside. Goes to meet the goalkeeper and then just slots this one away. And in a space of two minutes, after being the 1 0, Spurs lead two goals to one over Newtown. What a comeback! And Burgers, you're not allowed to go on the field, mister. <laughs> well, Sharks, Sharks, Sharks not happy. I don't know why. Why is Sharks not happy? And I hope Sharks are right. Here comes Rompey trying to get the equalizer. Still where does Newtown gets us one on the inside. Ball balls is now to Rompey again. And the goalkeeper saves the day to keep it at two goals to one. The youngster just waiting for the whistle to blow. Then it blew. Spurs come from 1-0 to beat Newtown to one. <laughs>